And meanwhile, students at more than 20 public school districts in the county are getting an extended Thanksgiving break. So they say this is all to give these students more time to essentially focus on their own mental health. Districts in at least six states and Florida's included have added these wellness days to their school year. Now, Palm Beach, St. Lucie, Indian River and Okeechobee County School Districts already have all of next week off. As far as Brevard County, they say they will allocate two unused hurricane days to also extend the Thanksgiving break. Well, Palm Beach County students have a chance to receive meals now for the holiday break. 16 different locations providing pickup for these meals. Each site has about 250 to 500 bags of meals, and they include nine meals and nine snacks. Josie Carbonari has the story. It's a struggle many have come to know too well over the last two years. I went from having a full-time job to a part-time job, so my hours got cut in half, so I'm still playing catch-up. Deborah Fertig has a 12-year-old son in middle school. She says these bags filled with nine meals and nine snacks provided by Palm Beach County School District will make a difference over the Thanksgiving holiday. Meals help tremendously. I mean, the my big concern right now is the prices going up for food. So I used to budget $600 a month for food. Now I'm budgeting $800. And that's just for me and a 12-year-old and a couple of cats. Other parents sharing similar stories. We're having a little bit of hard times right now as it is. Uh, so this is definitely going to be able to help out. According to the district, about 64% of students are currently enrolled for food assistance. Part of the reason meal distributions around the holidays are needed. Any little bit that I get is a little breathing room. Happy holidays, thank you. Josie Carbonari, WPBF 25 News. And we have the remaining pickup sites today scrolling on your screen right now. For more on these distributions, just go to the school district's website and keep in mind these meals are first come, first serve during pickup. Your child won't need to be with you. But parents and guardians, you will need to show the student's ID or any of the other items that you see here on your screen.